Good morning, St. Luke. We welcome you again to our worship service. I invite you right now to reach in your bulletin and get out the connection card and begin completing that. We'll collect those in just a moment during the offering. If you're a guest with us, this information is very helpful for us to connect with you. Christmas is coming and one wonderful way to get ready for that is to attend our cantata this Wednesday at 7 p.m. in the traditional sanctuary. We'll be able to sing Christmas carols together and our choir will lead us in some wonderful music. You'll notice on the back of the connection card are some opportunities for you to help, to volunteer. The first is faith mission. This is our last opportunity this year to serve homeless families at Faith Mission, so consider doing that. You notice that the next set of volunteers all have to do with Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve, as you understand, is a big deal for us. And we need lots of help to make this the best Christmas Eve that we can. Our theme this year is that we are having a Christmas for Columbus and we're inviting people to come and learn that God is for you. So one way you can help is to set up, help set up for Christmas. Another is to bring some cookies for Christmas Eve that will serve the people that come. And thirdly, to be a worship servant. So consider doing that. There's a lot of spots to fill. We're having a, an additional Christmas Eve service on the 23rd this year at 7 p.m. This is for people who for whatever reason want to work, share Christmas Eve with us but can't attend on the 24th. And then on the 24th we have five services like we've had in the past. Two, four, six, eight, and ten. The four o'clock service is in the fellowship hall and it's a contemporary style. All the rest of the services are in the traditional sanctuary. All the services will have the singing of Christmas carols, a wonderful Christmas message, how God is for you, Holy Communion, singing a silent night, candlelight. And we have special invitation cards that are on the seat today that you can take. There's extras at the information center. And that's all the information you can use to invite someone to come to Christmas Eve. And let me tell you, people are waiting to be invited to Christmas Eve. So consider picking these up and give, inviting some folks that you know. On the back of the connection card, you notice that the last sign up is for to host a life group. In February, we're going to have a church-wide life group campaign that connects with what's going on on Sunday morning during the sermon. It's called the Artisan Soul, and it's about crafting our lives into the work of art by discovering who God has made us to be. We are really excited about this creative series. And if you've thought about being in a life group in the past, maybe consider hosting. In this way, you can set the day and the time to have your life group. And if you would like to know more about that, just check that box in the back of the cards. One of our life group team will call you and answer all your questions as you consider whether to be a host. We're now going to receive our offering for the morning, and please put those connection cards in the plate. 